Today we have five artists competing for a hundred thousand dollars, and I'm gonna give them five hundred thousand jelly beans to create some amazing art. <laughs> More on that later. But for now, here's what happened last time. <laughs> I think I did a pretty good job at scaring the artists. At times, they even scared Dana and I. I'm messy. <laughs> But the scariest part was when one of our top contenders dug her own grave. Hey, Marissa, you're gonna be sent home today. It's a win just being picked to be here. We started out with 10 artists, now we're down to five. It's time for Instant Influencer with me, CHC. I miss my brush. I need a new one. Too bad you ain't gonna get one. Oh, Man, it doesn't fight the word. Nick might be my biggest competition. I can feel it. So I need to win this challenge because I almost got that victory at the mannequin challenge and I want to have that track record that really sets me apart from everyone else. Hey, artists. Hi. 20 burpees right now. Oh, go. Oh, gosh. Wait. Wait, really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> with the push-up. Like, I'm so tired of running. I'm tired of doing push-ups. I'm tired of... Just, I'm just tired. No, you know what? Like, 20's a bit much. I did three. All right, just That's 10, enough. just 10. That's enough. Oh. That's enough. <laughs> okay. Is everyone awake now? Yeah. yeah. Just curious, do any of you like any sports? Just put it up. <laughs> David. <laughs> what sports do you like, David? Girl, I don't know. <laughs> There's baseball. so many sports. Baseball, David. You like baseball? Yeah. <laughs> no, <it's not>. okay. <laughs> I couldn't name a single baseball team. Okay, well, we're not doing real sports today, but you will need to have a lot of endurance for what we're gonna do next. A lot of endurance. I'm ready. Because artists today, yeah, we're throwing you straight into the dun da 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 the art athlon. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's completely fine. I played sports my whole life, so let's go. You will be competing in a series of five events. Got it. And you will need to do pieces of art, but here's the deal. You know he's always got to throw a wrench into it, right? Always. Yeah. In true Zach form, you only have 10 minutes. <laughs> okay. 10 minutes? I'm supposed to do all five challenges in 10 minutes. That's what, like 600 seconds? Artists, on your workstations, you'll each have five boxes. And each of those boxes contain instructions and tools for each event. Ooh. Zach will award artists with the best overall pieces with the art title of Art Athlon Champion. Yes. And to help you out, you'll also win this. <gasps> That's my brush. I need another <laughs> brush, honey. That's my brush. <laughs> I don't exactly know what it's for yet, but I know I want it. <laughs> This will be the last chance you have to win an advantage brush. Oh. Yeah, you guys want this. Remember how important this is? You've seen this brush and you've seen what it can do. You don't want to yeah. miss out on this one. Brace yourself. It's a biggie. Okay, artists. Are you ready? Yes. yes. Ooh. Get set. Oh. <laughs> Art. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh the clock oh. started back. Oh, my God. <laughs> Draw from five feet away? What? This is the craziest thing I've ever seen. Is this a selfie stick? Okay. Wait, this is crazy. How do you? <laughs> what? This is actually not possible. Are we social distancing with the canvas now? I can't even reach. Why do you do this to them? Why do you do I don't this know. to them? I don't know. I should have made it 10 minutes each. This is so hard. It's so hard, I can't even like draw a straight line with this. I mean, I can't draw a straight line anyways, but this is really hard. What is- What? It's a nose, it's a nose. Wait, David I thought is it was doing a mushroom. A nose. Oh, maybe it is a mushroom. Oh, he's so cute. 30 seconds left for box one. Oh, oh my gosh. No. This is not going as I thought it was. Oh, wow. Ooh, so I see a banana. It's a fruit bowl situation. Nick is moving fast, but it's starting to get a little messy at the sides. I'll make up for it. Three, two, oh. one. Box two. Move on to box uh. two. Okay. Draw upside down. How? Okay. It's not easy drawing 
something upside down. This is insane. Each one harder than the next. I'm just gonna go with what I like a lot. I love sitting down and having some coffee, reading a book. Why not do that? I need this brush. I want this brush. I think I definitely have the artwork portion down, but I really want to get this brush because it's really hard to prove yourself when everybody is doing amazing work around you. Drawing upside down isn't really that big of a problem to me because I used to draw all of my portraits upside down to get the proportions right. Who wants the oh, wow. title? Wow, Nick's just champion. going at it now. Look at oh, that. Oh, wow, wow. Look at, oh. I'm not even going to give them a countdown. Time's up, box number three. Oh! Oh! Okay. Okay. Oh, no. Cut out silhouette of ZHC. What? Okay. Oh, my God. Sounds... <laughs> Are we supposed to see something? Dana, you're going to have to carry on this one because I can't move. Go, 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 go. I can't see from my seat. OK, Nick, on the floor. You know, using a strategy. There's nothing more that I want now to win this brush. I need this the next challenge. You want the brush? Show them. I want it. It's you don't want it that bad. Oh. <laughs> David's very intimidated by my presence. <laughs> nah. Goes up right down there. Like, I think we're all kind of screwed with this one. And model, you hold the pose. <laughs> 10 seconds, keep ah, cutting. Ah. You want to make sure it's finished. Oh, and this is interesting. Scissors down, move on to box four. Paint with condoms? Oh, no. I love food art. Except for it smells weird. Oh my God, it smells like mustard. <laughs> Obviously. It's not coming. Okay, well, that was not not a great start. Did you actually come up with this idea while enjoying a hot dog? Yes, I did. Because I eat my hot dogs plain and I was like, I have all this plain. ketchup and mustard left. What do I do with it? What kind of monster are you, a plain hot dog? You know, the mustard's gross. Oh wow, Ryan Ooh. is going crazy right now. I've spent so much time at home telling my kids not to use condiments as art, and here I am making art with it. This is so gross. <laughs> All right, final one, box five, no. go. Oh my gosh. Draw a face on a jelly bean. Draw a face. What the oh, fuck? A jelly bean. That's really small, though. There's no way. All I know is that they're going to have a hard time doing it. Let's see here. Okay. My hands are a little shaky, so trying to hold like a small jelly bean and really get detail on it is kind of crazy. My hands are like shaking right now. I can't even hold it. This is so freaking hard. We're coming to the final stretch of the art athlon. Are you excited to see what everyone has created for you? I sure am, Dana. It's yes. down to crunch time. I hope none of them choke. Five, four, three, two, oh. one. Finish! Oh, oh. The art athlon is over. Come to the finish line. Yay! Congrats! Dana, that is definitely going in this week's highlight reel. Oh, yeah. Artists, I'm going to come around to your workstations and see how you did. All right, Nick. Upside down art. Mountain scenery. Nice. My silhouette. I look pretty good in that. But a bird. Nick was going bananas on the mustard. Is it enough? Let's watch. Very nice, Nick. Thank you. All right, moving on. OK, Sophie. Hey. Let's take a look. I'm a little nervous, but I hope Zach likes it. I think he will. Bowl of fruits. Oh, very nice. Thank you. That's pretty. <laughs> This is the toughest one, in my opinion. Very personal to Zach, clearly, because it's his face. Looking good. <laughs> Thank you, Sophie. Thank you. I impressed myself with my artwork, so I think I have this one locked in. Tell me what this is, Ryan. It's not anybody in particular. I just like to draw portraits. Ryan, where's the rest of the face? Uh-oh, sounds like he's missing something. Didn't have enough time for that. <laughs> Right, fair enough. I'm not too happy with the face I drew, but the condiment art in the five feet painting looks pretty cool. I see what you did with these. Ryan is the only one that had a common theme throughout his collection of 
Is that going to matter to Zach when he makes his decision? All right. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you. Okay, mushroom. Oh, very pretty. Thank y'all. Will it match? Ooh. David is shaking his head yes, but is that the case? Oh, the pony's getting abducted. The unicorn. By the frog. Yeah. Same as Mo. No other contestant has named the jelly bean yet. Ooh, this jelly bean's giving me some attitude. My jelly bean, she was serving food, and she was here to win. I loved her. Very nice, David. Thank you. Hey, JB. Hey, Zach. The thing about JB is that this could be a turning point for her. Oh, nice flower. Oh, you did it this way. Yeah, he's cuter that way. <laughs> Very cute. Is it enough to get her to win? Thanks, JB. Thanks, Zach. OK, artists, it's time to crown the champion. Zach? The artist that would become the first ever Instant Influencer Art Athlon Champion is... David. Get out of here. Yeah. Oh my God. There we go. David, you will also win our final advantage brush, the ZHC brush. Yes, I'm so excited. I won the brush, but I'm also a little confused on how to use it or what I'm going to use it for. This brush will allow you to get 15 minutes of assistance from one of the greatest art athletes of our generation. The one, the only, ZHC. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Dana. <laughs> yeah, it's only 15 minutes, though. Dana, should we bring it down to 10? No, no, oh, no. Oh, see? Don't do that. You don't see do that. what happened? Just kidding. OK, David, <laughs> come up and get your brush. Yeah. Wow. David. You. David, come here. Oh, come here. Get, get your medal. Yes. Get your medal. Metal. Yes. So exciting. OK, David, you can use this brush on one of the next three elimination challenges moving forward, including the one we're about to do right now. So let's go. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> David, is that metal heavy? A little bit, she's big. <laughs> <laughs> All right, some of you might already know this, but my YouTube career first took off from the videos that I made recreating some noob art that my friends did. They'd draw something and I'd redraw it in my own style. It was really fun and honestly, I thought it was hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> and for today's elimination challenge, that's exactly what you're gonna do. In order to make it big as an influencer, you need a lot of subscribers, yes? Yeah. In order to be a really good influencer, you need to engage with those subscribers. So today, you will be recreating drawings done by five of Zach's subscribers. Oh, so cool. <laughs> On your tablets, you'll see an image of what you have to recreate, but it's not about just copying the image. It's really about expanding on it and making it your own. Yes, I like okay. that. Okay, like artists, that. you've got everything you need. Time starts. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I have something else to tell them. Oh, shoot. Oh, I knew it. I knew there was a catch. You guys thought it would be so easy, huh? Well. Not today. You're going to be recreating my subscribers' drawings using nothing but jelly beans. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's raining jelly beans. I have to do it with freaking jelly beans. What the heck? How am I going to do that? And they're still going. Artists, eat up. <laughs> I do not like jelly beans. I can't even believe I ate them. I Maybe I'll one. eat jelly beans while you guys do your art because time starts now. Oh, oh get God. to work. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. Hey, Zach. It's Natalie from Browns Mills, New Jersey. Yeah. Hey, it's Jacqueline from Baldwin Park. It's me, Jago. I'm from the Philippines. I'm Nuri from Kazakhstan. Hello, my name is Carol in South Africa. Oh, that's sick. Jado. I enjoy this hat because. I really want to have a cut. It's so cute. I drew this weird, creepy looking creature because I thought these colors embody the galaxy. I really love her sketch and I'm so excited to give it a little more personality. 
This is the beginning artwork because I really love butterflies. Another butterfly on the show. <laughs> I finally feel like a part of the team now because now it's my turn to do a butterfly. A butterfly. <laughs> <laughs> I drew this squirrel that looked like it belonged to a video game. Natalie's a goddess. Hey, Natalie, I love your squirrel. The squirrel is so cute and I can't wait to see what I can do with it. The artwork that I submitted is inspired by the weather. You have the lightning limbs, you have the raindrops as the fingertips and the wind as the body. The creativity, man, in her brain is insane. I just gotta figure out how I'm gonna elevate this drawing a little bit. That is so awesome. Bye. 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 Good luck. Let's make this cat happen. Let's go shopping. Oh my God. Move out the way. Oh, 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 oh. yep. Okay. Oh. One of these. Oh, this is. You know what? We're gonna do this. And is this allowed? I'm gonna need some of this. Oh my god. Never thought I would ever do this. Oh, it's so cute. I'm like looking at this squirrel drawing, and I have no idea how to draw a squirrel. Got a gorgeous little squirrel. A magical squirrel. She loves video games, so I have to make sure that this feels very animated. Okay, A6000 is the way to go. Oh, he's a very cute volcano, so we're gonna stick with that. <laughs> the main focus for me is gonna be this volcano. I wanna make it cartoony, I want it to make it look cute, and we can figure out something with the arms. <laughs> I'm glad I did not get a butterfly, All I'm right. sorry. Those, those are traumatizing for me now. I feel a lot of pressure getting a butterfly. It's landed people on the top and the bottom, so I've gotta be careful with this. My plan on elevating this butterfly is going to be to make it very proportional and to get some of my shading in there with the different colors. So cute. I actually love this picture so much. Her sketch is similar to my style. This girl with long hair and a geometric kind of body and face, and she really put a lot of cute details into it. So I'm going to try to combine it with something that was really colorful and fun. What was yours again? I got a cat, a beautiful cat. Oh, wow. I'm so, so Do excited. the cat justice. Jay drew a really nice cat, and I love space art, so let's combine them and make space cat. Volcanoes are brown, I think. <laughs> There's no brown jelly beans. I need brown and this brown. So maybe if I were just to throw some paint and some white jelly beans and mix it all together, we'll get some brown jelly beans. I thought I added too little paint, but I guess not. They look like pinto beans. On top of the brown for the volcano, I have to make a whole bunch of gray jelly beans for the clouds. That is a lot of work and not a lot of time. This is gonna take so long. I feel like we're in yeah. a ZHD crafts video. <laughs> right? <laughs> I know, I've been thinking that the whole time. Yeah. I didn't realize how tedious it was to put every little jelly bean in a straight line. Ooh, it's gonna hurt my back. It's so hard, like, spreading the glue. Yes, damn, that glue is sticky. It is, it's like getting sticky, all over my fingers. right? My hands are starting to kill me. <laughs> I'm gonna go home all buff with all the running and push-ups and burpees. <laughs> David, have I told you you've been quiet today? <laughs> this is hard. I'm like laser focusing. Yeah. I mean, usually I hear something from here Dead. from you, but <laughs> not hearing too much over there. I start with the details, and I should have just started with the general picture of it. But I got that too much gene, and it keeps messing me up a little bit. So I am stressing so much right now. It's a lot harder than it looks. You've got your top five artists left. One of them is going to be your instant influencer. I want you to get to know them more. Like, what are they gonna do if they win? Hey, Sophie. Hello. When do you plan on peeling the glue off of your hands and I washing it? Knew, Cause, cause that I is... knew you would, I don't even wanna show you my hands because I knew that you were gonna say something. You're just seeing a lot of glue on your hands this glue fingers. Is, no, it's very sticky. Should you Take home this crown. Do you think that fashion past of yours will continue to go through and shine through in your art? Yes, I think this would be such a great opportunity to be able to showcase not only my art, but my passion for fashion and really just making content about what people want to see, so. Hey, that would that rhyme would so great. well with your passion for fashion. Passion for fashion, <laughs> I love that. I'm sorry, I'm getting distracted yeah. by the super glue just getting dragged all over the piece. <laughs> I was like, why is he cringy right now? That's why, okay. Watch for that. Hey, David. How did pink hair David come to be? Like, when did this become your signature look? How did that even happen? Oh my God, whatever color my hair ends up being, 
That's like the color that all the art becomes. Do you feel the same way? Dana, look at our set. <laughs> I know, literally. <laughs> I feel like I've gotten to a point where I've worked so hard to be confident in who I am and how I look and how I feel. I want to help as many people as possible like connect with their true selves yes. and feel like they can live how they want. You know? Shine on bright pink. Yes. <laughs> All right, David, keep working. Good Thank luck, good you. luck, good Thank luck. You. Hi, guys. Hi. Hey, Ryan. Hey. We're at the halfway mark. Yep. What is your driving force? Who's your biggest fan? Yeah, my kids are the main reason that I've started this journey. Yeah. They've just pushed me to try new things and do different stuff, kind of like the show, and it's been really fun. Yeah. And it's just the joy that it's bringing them, you know, being a part of it and watching me. It, I love that feeling. Like, it gives me goosebumps. It makes Aww. me feel good that I'm helping someone. Yeah. So I would love to be able to do that with a bigger yeah. audience and help other people. OK. Just curious, do you have a message for any of your kids watching right now? <laughs> yes, I miss you guys so much. Thanks for um, you know allowing me to do this and talking me into doing it and finding it and everything. So I wouldn't be here without you guys. I love you. I'm That's sure your thing. kids are very sweet and I'm glad they pushed you into doing this. Yes, me too. And my wife's a superstar for watching all of them while I'm here. Love you, Megan. Thank you for uh -huh. everything you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> miss you. Miss you. Good luck. All right, we'll look, we'll let you keep working. All right, thank you guys. All right, bye, bye, Ryan. Thanks. Hi, JB. Hey, guys. How's it going? We were talking about what, what's what's your road to getting here been like? Yes. Yeah, so I was actually planning to go to law school. What? Yeah. I got a job at a law firm because I wow. wanted to see how it was. That's where I work at now. And then, you know, I really started getting into art. And so that's why I'm, like, pursuing that. I'm trying to become a full-time artist. Paint as much as I can. Um, sometimes I have to wake up, like, early before work to paint or I have to stay up, like, super late. And wow. I take it your dream is to just like make your passion like your job. Yeah, it's wow. definitely different, but I'd much rather do this. <laughs> All right, get back to yeah. work. Thanks, guys. Bye. You were in law school? You were going to go to law school, JB? Oh my gosh, nobody knows that about me. <laughs> wow. Yes. Oh, Nick, you're using gloves. I am, yeah. <laughs> I think that's smart. It feels really gross when you have glue on your hands. Oh, it's the worst. I hate it. <laughs> Should Zach crown you the winner, what is this going to help you do? I quit my job a little bit ago to like really, well, I kind of got laid off oh. actually. I didn't really quit. Okay. <laughs> that really kind of made me focus on art full time. And uh, I just want to do it all the time. Take it right now, you're just in grind mode. Grind mode. Mm. Yeah. And that's what I did early on too. I kept working every day for it. If you're able to do that and keep manifesting it, I think it's going to happen. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. I'll keep grinding. How are we going to get this done? We are. It's going to happen. This is crazy. We're going to have to count all of them when we're done. Wait, really? <laughs> oh, I thought you were being serious. I was no, gonna I say that's gonna that's gonna take forever. Right. Artists, twenty-two minutes. I am elevating Natalie's gorgeous squirrel by making it feel like the squirrel evolved into this like forest goddess. I wanted to put it in a scene and make it as dynamic as possible, but it takes a lot of time. My hands are covered in so much glue. It's stupid. I it's know. Gross. Same. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dana, hmm? are you eating their art supplies? Don't worry, look, I got this on lock, man. You don't even have to watch me. I'm good. Six minutes left. I can't believe I ever thought three hours was a long time for this challenge. <laughs> it's almost finished. How do you think everybody's doing so far? Not everyone has everything covered yet. I'm a little bit concerned with time, and some of them aren't really transforming what was given to them. Sophie, how you doing? Mm, not the best. <laughs> I still don't have the full canvas covered, and jelly beans are sliding off the canvas. I think I can get it done. I think I'm good. Artists, I have good news. One minute. OK, one last second. Let's get hurry, 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 oh, hurry, Nick, run, hurry. Nick. <gasps> oh my god. At this point, I'm just covering it in jelly beans. No organization, just cover the space. Oops, sorry, sorry. Oh, no. <laughs> We're running out of time, but I want to add a little smiley face to make it pop. It better dry before they start reading us, because I need this to work. 
sticking those jelly beans on there and realizing that it's not doing what I wanted it to do. Five, four, three, two, one. Artist, time is up. Holy moly. Okay. <laughs> That's how I feel, just, that was hard. That was very, very hard. All right, good job, everyone. I covered every space, okay. I underestimated the hell out of that one. Come on, come on, come on, but you I did that. I think my piece is really cute. I think it's dynamic, and I think I elevated the squirrel really well. It's a little messy. These better stick. But I think I'm feeling, I'm feeling good, I think. Our back is killing me. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, artists. Hi. Hey. How was it working with the jelly beans? It was yeah. interesting. Oh, it was fun. <laughs> Sophie, how are you feeling? I still have a little glue on my fingers, but I'm doing okay. And Nick, how are you feeling? Feeling pretty good. I'm feeling pretty good. Ro, how are you doing? I'm doing great. I'm ready to compete. I'm ready to win. This is going to be a blast, huh, guys? Oh. Where did you come from? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realize Ro was standing right next to us. I freaking love Rosanna. I grew up watching Rosanna on YouTube, and she's like one of the OGs. <laughs> You're quiet, Ro. Oh, my God. Ro. Aren't you supposed to be up here? Oh, I get it, I get it. I'll head over, hey everybody. Hi. 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 Hello. Oh, wow, the view's very different from over here. Bro, why were you down there? I read the email wrong. <laughs> Artists, say hi to Rosanna Pensia. Hi. hi, everybody. Nice to meet you. Ro is an award-winning YouTuber and the host of Baketopia. She's also an amazing baker who's published multiple cookbooks. Zach, what are we doing here today? These artists over here made art out of jelly beans. Mm. We're going to take a look at them right now. Are you ready? Sounds beautiful and delicious. <laughs> well, Ro, you take off that tag, girl. Oh, yeah. OK. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm not uh, competing today. I'm grot. grot. You're, you're grot. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay, guys, are we ready? I'm ready. All righty, artists. Let's see this candy art. I'm so scared. I'm like freaking out. JB's freaking out, and I feel so bad. It stayed on when we like turned it, but it was dripping glue. So let's let's speed up this critique. Oh my gosh. This is this is not gonna go well. JB, come yes. on up. Yeah. My subscriber, Carol from South Africa, sent you a piece. Let's take a look at that right now. All right, JB, let's see what you made out of Carol's art. Yeah, slowly. Oh my gosh, okay, it's together. Is that glue dripping? Let's not talk about it. How do you feel right now? I feel awful. <laughs> Why do you feel awful? There was a lot to do with this one. It was, it was hard. It's very, very hard. The background throws me off. It's too much going on. And I think you tried, like, with the features, with the nose, like, you were trying to add some dimension, yeah? Yeah. Instead, it just looks like it was all piled up. What I do think you did well was adding the paint to those cream soda jelly bean, I remember it well. Tossing that in the paint allowed you to really mimic the look of a volcano. Your subscriber gave you such a creative character. There's so much going on in it. And first of all, you didn't show half of it. The features on the face, the black and the browns match too much. I just don't think it came together well for me. Why am a sucker for volcanoes? Is he holding something? Is the volcano Hold, what's this over the lightning bolt? His fingers are supposed to be rain, so he's supposed to be reaching up into the clouds to grab the rain. He's grabbing the yeah, rain. It's, it was hard to do, work with these <laughs> jelly beans and get any details in there, so it was, it was really tough. Thanks for explaining that. I was noticing this, and yeah. I was like, what? What? <laughs> All right, JB. Thank you. That's embarrassing. OK, Ryan, you're up. Yes. All right, Ryan, let's take a look at what Jacqueline, my subscriber from the US, sent you to make. All right. Ah, another butterfly. So, Ro, to fill you in, there's been a <laughs> thing with butterflies. OK. And Zach here has had his fair share of looking at butterflies. All right, Ryan, let's see your jelly bean art. Oh my gosh. Ryan, you're giving me a heart attack. I oh know. <laughs> <gasps> wow. I love
love the color that you added to the piece. Thank you. In the original art, it is simple, but I wanted to see more color when that popped on the screen. And then I was so happy when you unveiled your art and there was a lot more color. Thank you. I like the butterfly. <laughs> I'm not sick of butterflies. <laughs> the smiley face is making it a, a bit juvenile, but I like the way that you shaded it and I, I think it's a fun piece. Thank you. The subscriber gave you a very simple butterfly, but I feel like you gotta change up the composition a bit, make it look a little bit more dynamic. I wanna see some more movement. I want to see it not just like a straight on butterfly like what your subscriber gave you. Okay. All right, Ryan, thank you so much. Thanks. Up next is David. Oh, no! David, let's see what my subscriber, Natalie, from yes. the US sent over to you. So freaking precious. <laughs> let's take a look at what you made out of jelly beans. Are you ready? Ooh, reveal. <gasps> oh! No. <laughs> <laughs> my squirrel. <laughs> David, are those blue things acorns? Yeah, they're little magical nuts. Go snacking on them. Blue nuts. Yeah. She's got a mouthful of nuts. <laughs> Living her best life. I thought they were blueberries. <laughs> this original art and the art that you've created, it's definitely the same creature. It's got the little mohawk. Yes. But this one is so much more elevated. It's so colorful and it has so much more character with the cheeks and the eyes. I love that you added your signature hot pink yes. right on the tips of the tail. I like so many things about this. You were very creative on this piece. You put it in a little scenery and you didn't just use the subscriber's composition. You changed it up. The body is different. It's in a different pose. It's looking at me a different way. One thing I would add though for that tree, that's a tree, right? Yeah. I would have added a few highlights here and there just to separate it out from the purple because the purple and black are both pretty dark colors. Thank you, David. Good job. All right, Nick, you're up. Sweet. All right, Nick, let's see what my subscriber, Jay from the Philippines, sent you to make. <laughs> my dude, Jay. And Nick, let's see what you did. Space kitty. What a reveal. Nick, is the cat supposed to represent an Earth-like kind of pattern? Uh, not really. It's just supposed to be a intergalactic cat. I wanted to make it from a different planet. So there's Earth in the background, oh. and he's in space. I guess the color palette is kind of the same. Well, I thought it was an Earth cat, and I thought that was really cool. That's exactly it. It's an Earth cat. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 that's what I thought. <laughs> I would have liked to see a little bit more of the planets in the background, because you were saying it's intergalactic. For sure. I have to agree with Zach. I do wish that in the background, you would have given like maybe a shooting star or maybe something else to let you know that he's in space or she. I don't know if this cat is a he or she <laughs> right. uh, or they. Yeah. Um, but I think this is so damn cute. Ah, oh, thanks. <laughs> if I were this subscriber, I would have wanted to see the whole body. It was missing the tail. It's great, but just like missing half of the character. Yeah, gotcha, it makes sense for sure. What was up with all the super glue at the end? <laughs> I feel kind Nick of... is just straight up dumping glue at this point. Yeah, he is. Nick, is that gonna dry? It'll dry. It will. Dana, I don't think it's gonna dry. I don't either. <laughs> <laughs> I was uh, making sure that my beans were gonna stick and hopefully make it shine a little bit, but it just didn't make any difference. But uh... <laughs> <laughs> I'm really impressed by this. You took a very simple piece of art and you added so much depth and creativity. It's not just a cat. It really does look like the Earth, <laughs> right? I, yeah. It looks like Earth cat. All right, good job, Nick. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Me? Wow. I was supposed to be meow, but uh, that was too corny. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Sophie, let's see your jelly bean art. Okay. <laughs> One of my subscribers, Nuri from Kazakhstan, sent you a piece. Let's take a look at it. It's really cute. I love it, honestly. <laughs> First off, are you still triggered from all of the glue that was on Sophie's hand? I had a quick nap and I tried to forget about it, but, but now that you mention it. All right, well, let's see your art. Ta -da. 
Sophie, I think she's really cute. I think what I love so much about this is that each of those geometric shapes looks like a quilted pattern to me. Her face with her little shot of pink highlight is very fun, and I think you added some personality to your piece from the original art. Nuri sent you a geometrical character. Keeping it geometric, right now it still looks flat. As the professional artist, it's your job to elevate that, and you didn't elevate it enough. You could have made the body look a little three-dimensional. This piece isn't bad, but I think you played it safe. I want to see more ambitious projects from you. Give yourself permission to go a little bigger. I know from working with food that some foods are easier to work with than others. Making really clean lines with jelly beans <laughs> is not easy. And I really appreciate those clean edges I'm seeing because I know that that's not easy to do. Okay, thank you. All right, thank you, Sophie. Thank you. I'm definitely going home. <laughs> There's no way I'm staying. I'm so very disappointed in myself. I'm sad. I'm mentally preparing myself to go home. Artists, this is a very big decision to make. And because of how complicated this challenge is, um, today there is no winner. Um, what? So I'm going to send you all back to your video base right now. All right, Ro, Dana, let's talk about what we thought. I know that all art's different, but as a medium, when you're working with food, especially yeah. um, these little candies, working with food is not easy. Yeah. And I'm seeing dimension, like these cat's eyes. To get dimension with jelly beans was very talented. I, I think David and Nick did a really great job in terms of adding depth. But Zach, where are you in terms of who you think did not perform so well today? I thought Sophie's was okay. For me, this felt very safe for her. Yeah, I wanted her to go bigger. Same here, yeah. Ryan's piece I thought was super colorful, but for it to still remain flat, I think is disappointing. Yes, he elevated his subscriber's art, but he played it too safe. And then for JB's, I actually feel like she took away from her subscriber's art. Her subscriber was so creative with the design. She only included half of that in. Yeah, so you've you've got a you've got a tough decision. But you know the right decision to make because you are ZHC. I hate being in this room. I've avoided it for so long and being back here is the worst. It's just so defeating and this really sucks. I'm deflated. It's really like hitting me like, JB, you just let so many people down. So many people, including yourself. It's a lot of emotions going through my head. Hi, artists. I'm talking to all of you. So obviously today's challenge was extremely tough. Some of you did well, some of you not so well, but I believe in all of you as artists, and I also believe in second chances. So, today, nobody is going home. I am only doing this once, so don't think that this will happen all the time. Those of you that haven't been quite keeping up, now's your chance to really, really step up. Artists, come out to the lounge. Just give me a second. Stop, don't cry, baby, we're not doing this. I wasn't expecting that. I was not expecting that. Oh. <laughs> I'm super stoked to have made it through to another challenge. Oh, my God. I'm so happy. Oh, my God. I promise that I'm not embarrassing myself like that again. I'm not going to be given a third chance. So I'm re strategizing. I'm getting everything together. I'm changing my mindset on everything. And I'm never going to put out a piece of work like that again. As much as this is a competition, they're all my friends, and I don't want to see any of them go. Does that mean that I'm not going to beat them? No. That was insane. We've been through a lot. ZHC puts us through some challenges. If 
This was hard and it's supposed to get harder? Uh, guys, cut it out, man. Come on, get together, guys. We made it. Everybody, get up. <laughs> no matter what, we made it this far and uh, yes. I love you guys. High fives for top five, come on. <laughs>